folks, it's Sarah with Obadiahs. Today I am here to show you guys how to use your damper controls on the Baker's Choice cook stove. There are just two simple damper controls on this particular unit, so the stove is super easy to operate. Um, here you do have two different turn dial controls. They are righty tighty, lefty loosey, so when you are facing the side of the stove, if you go to the left or towards the back of the stove, that's going to open, and then um, spin forward towards the front of the stove is going to be closed. This is just going to open an air inlet into the firebox. So this is essentially going to be your primary damper control. You do want these wide open or all the way to the back of the stove to the left when getting your fire started. You do have your bypass damper control, which is located on the rear of the stove. I'll take you guys behind the stove so you can see that as well. When you are facing the front of the stove, the damper is actually going to be over on the right hand side so you would access it from the oven side. And when you're standing facing the, the front of the stove, if you reach your hand to the right and you pull it all the way to the right hand, that's going to be wide open, pushed all the way in is going to close that bypass damper. Again, when starting your fire, you always want that bypass damper wide open so that your smoke can exit the chimney. I recommend burning your fire good and hot for at least 30 to 40 minutes before you go to adjust that bypass damper um, when you're first getting that fire fire lit to make sure that you have a good hot fire and clean smoke circulating around the oven. Your bypass damper is also how you will control your oven temperature on this Baker's Choice as well. Here we have up close the dial controls for the Baker's Choice. Again, righty tighty lefty loosey, so rolled to the back is going to open up these dampers for you. Um, rolling them to the front is going to close it. And each of these dampers, they're basically the same damper control, but they just give you two of them for more air control. And then the back of the stove on the, on the Baker's Choice is pretty simple here. Um, here's your oval to round adapter. This comes with the stove. This is a single wall adapter. And then you do have your simple bypass damper. Again, pulled out, open, pushed in is going to be closed. So I hope you guys found this video helpful on how to use your damper controls on the Baker's Choice cook stove. As always, if you guys like these videos, please give me that thumbs up. Click the subscribe button in the corner of the channel. Thanks so much for watching. Have a wonderful day.